Mrs. Sharma and Mr. Sharma, Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja, along with four other, other persons, are to be seated at a round table for dinner. Nice. If Mrs. and Mr. Sharma are to be seated next to each other, and Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja are not to be seated next to each other, then the total number of seating arrangements are lovely, lovely. For eight people around a circle, eight people around a circle is seven factorial, that we know. But this is not that. We are told that there are two couples. One couple have to be seated next to each other. Another couple, Mrs. and Mr. Sharma are to be seated next to each other. And Mrs. and Mrs. Aguja are not to be seated next to each other. Fine. Our problem for circular arrangement, let's say n people are to be arranged around a circle, only relative positions are there. So that's why the answer is not n factorial, but n minus 1 factorial. Because a circle does not have a starting step and an end step. The whole idea of circular arrangement kicks only relatively. So we place one person sit there around that person or next to that person, next to next to that person, this side and that side, we seat everybody else. I want to follow the same approach. Mr. and Mrs. and Mr. Sharma are to be seated next to each other. So I say, Mrs. and Mr. Sharma, two seats are taken by them. It's the Sharma family. Then we have one, two, three, four, five, six seats left. Right? Around these two, these six can be placed. The second condition we are not there. Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja are not to be seated next to each other. Assume that condition is not there. Then we can say six people, six seats. Now the circular arrangement idea is not there because the Sharmas are together. They anchor my positioning. I'll have one, two, three, four, five, six. One position to the left, two positions to the left, three to the left, four to the left, five to the left, six to the left. Out of this block, I'm through six factorial. To keep one thing in mind, Mrs. and Mr. Sharma are together. They could be Mrs. and Mr., Mr. and Mrs. Both ways. So my answer would be 2 into 6 factorial. I could have Mrs. and wife and husband, husband and wife. Both will work. But it's not enough. It's not my answer. It's not 2 into 6 factorial because the 2 into 6 factorial does not account for the fact that Mrs. and Mr. Ajuhuja, Ahuja are not to be seated next to each other. How do we handle that not to be seated next to each other? I say, okay, let me count all possibilities where they are seated next to each other. I'll subtract that. My answer should have been 2 into 6 factorial. From this, I'm going to subtract all possibilities where they are not seated next to each other. Right? So, all possibilities where they are indeed seated next to each other. Sorry. That means, Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja could have been in these two seats. Or these two. Or these two. Or these two. Or these two. Combination 1, combination 2, combination 3, combination 4, combination 5. Assume they are in these two. Then there are 4 seats remaining, 4 people, 4 factorial ways. They were in these two, 4 seats remaining, 4 factorial ways. Or the number of ways that I should not count is 4 factorial into 5. Why 4 factorial? After I have put Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja, 4 seats are remaining. 4 people, 4 factorial ways. Why 5? Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja could be sitting next, could be sitting, seated next to each other in 5 different combinations. 1 and 2, 2 and 3, 3 and 4, 4 and 5, 5 and 6. One other thing that I need to remember here, which I kind of overlooked when I did this question originally, is the fact that Mrs. and Mr. Ahuja in each of these combinations could be husband and wife or husband and wife. Husband and wife, husband and wife. Husband and wife, husband and wife. So it is not just 4 factorial into 5, it is 4 factorial into 5 into 2. So for the husband and wife being, to, Mrs. and Mrs. Sharma being there in one position, I they could be in husband and wife here in taking these two slots and then I will have to subtract this much. So, if I had them here, I have 6 factorial combinations. From that, I will have to subtract this. And then, I could have them the other way around. From that, I will have to subtract this. So, husband and wife, husband and wife could happen both ways. It could be H and W, W and H for Sharmas. H and W, W and H for Ahujas. This is for the Ahuja part, this is for the Sharma part. Nice. 
Now, how do I combine this? I have to subtract one from the other. I have to keep one thing very careful in mind. Given one sequence of Sharmas, that is 6 factorial, I will have to subtract 4 factorial into 5 into 2. The whole thing into 2, for all of these arrangements, we are husband by one, wife and husband. So, 6 factorial minus 4 factorial into 5 into 2, whole thing into 2, husband and wife, wife and husband, each of those combinations. 6 factorial is 720, 5 into 2 is 10, 4 factorial is 24, this is 240, this is 2 times 720 minus 240, which is 2 times 480, which is 960. Excellent, excellent, excellent question. I want to go over the thought process one more time. I'm going to first think in terms of, hey, what do we do if we have the first condition alone in mind, Mrs. and Mrs. Sharma together, both of them together and six slots, six people, six factorial. Both of them together could be husband and wife, wife and husband, two into six factorial, total possibilities. So for each of those possibilities, one sequence of husband and wife here, I could have, I'm subtracting the scenarios where the Ahujas are also sitting together. So I'm sitting the Ahujas together. Because here, 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 and here. Five ways. Each of those five ways, there are four factorial ways for the remaining four people to sit. And each of those five ways, I could have H and W, H, W and H, H and W, W and H, each of them into two. Four into five, fact, four factorial into five into two, 240 ways in which we can seat the Ahujas such that they are seated together for each of those six factorial ways for the husband and wife like this, then husband and wife like this. So my final answer is two times six factorial minus this number. Assuming that husband and wife are here, wife and husband are here, I'll have to subtract this. Assuming wife and husband are like this, I have to subtract this. So twice of six factorial minus this 720 minus 240, 480, whole thing into 2, 960. Beautiful question, super charity question. Thank you.